Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing this girl. This is Makaria. Makaria? Anyway, she's from Bobby Boss. Stay tuned. And welcome back. Okay, so today I am going to review this girl. This is Makaria. Makaria. Anyway, she comes from Bobby Boss. And I got her in the color OL Peacock. All right. Her numbers are MLF378. Makaria. Makaria. I don't know. Anyway, I'm sure I'm butchering it. Anyway, she comes with a deep... Uh, Lace part, four and a half inches. She's a uh, lace front, so ear to ear, but I've taken her out and she's got a, just a tiny amount of lace, so she's not a 13 by six or anything like that. And it says she's made with HD transparent lace. She comes in a bunch of different colors, including one, one B, two, four. So she's got your natural colors. She's got some blondes. But today I ordered this girl an OL Peacock and here is the color. Look at that. And she is, oh, she's got fuzzies in there. She is super, super duper long. Can you see how long she is? Okay, anyway, um, let's go ahead and look at this girl's construction. Alrighty. She has two combs. What, in the front? Oh, one on each side, sorry. And she's got a comb in the back like that. And she has those nifty adjustable straps. The inside is open wefted, so she'll be nice and breathable. Okay? All right. It does say that she comes with baby hair, and she does. I can see them uh, right there. And you can see that lace right there. Okay? I've not done anything with her because I wanted to show her to you before I cut her lace. She's long, y'all. Okay, so I wanted to show her to you before I cut her lace off. Um, and she's the middle part. So let's just see what this girl does. Okay? Uh, here we go. All right. Okay. Um, the lace is curled. This girl was recommended to me a while ago, and this is just the first opportunity that I have had to get her, show her to you. Um, be a little hump going on, a little humpage. Okay, but here she is with that HD lace. It's on my forehead. I mean, you can see, but I can't see it. Like, in real life, I can see it a little bit, but on camera, it's almost complete, like, from here, it's almost completely gone. It's all the way down here. Okay, so this is how she looks with the lace on. I'm going to uh, cut this lace off, and she goes down. Oh, Lordy, y'all. She's really. Yeah, she's super. I'm going to show you how long she is when I come back. I'm going to cut this lace off and be right back. Now, welcome back. Okay, so I cut her lace. All right, y'all. And all I did was I just cut it as close as I could to the hairline. I did leave all the baby hair intact so you can see those. And uh, I'm going to put this girl back on. Okay, okay, all right. Uh, ow. Pulling, pulling. Okay. There we go. All right. And, you know, I use the back. I'm going to tell you what I do. Oof. I use the back comb, but I don't ever use the front combs. Yeah, it's a thing. I don't like them. All right. Let me get this girl on my, on my uh, hairline. Oh, she's a little crooked. She's got hump action. Um, I think, though, that it's probably from just being in the uh, box for 
so long. I've had this girl on a shelf sitting, well, I'm lying. I had her sitting on the floor for a hot minute now. So, um, again, like I said, this is the first opportunity I'm getting caught up in that wig grip of mine. There we go. Let's actually scooch her just a little bit further back. You can kind of see my hair right there. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna make sure that my hair is up. Because you can kind of see it, and I want you to just a tiny bit, but not a whole lot, because I was monkeying with her. All right, there we go. Okay, so here she is, y'all. Now again, I would take, um, and I'm just gonna show you the tool. I would take this. And I'm not doing it right now. And I would just like smooth down these sides, okay? And I don't have this turned on, y'all. It's not turned on, so it's not gonna do anything. But that's the tool I would use to get rid of this hump right here, okay? As far as anything else goes, with the exception of that hump, she is sitting pretty good on my forehead. Okay, so I'm not gonna have to glue this girl. She is not raising up at all. She's sitting right on my forehead. But you can see she does have some baby hair. I will just brush those in because I don't do anything with my baby hair. So if the wind flaps, you're going to see a little bit, but you know what? I'll just put some shader on it, make it black, and then it'll match my hair. Okay. Y'all, she's, look at these colors. That is fantastic. Oh my gosh, look at them. I'm going to pull all of this to the front so you can see the length of this chica. She is long. Okay, this is the undershelf right here. This girl goes all the way down to the boobage. I don't know what else to call it. Because <laughs> um, that's, you know, what they are. Okay, breasts? I don't know. Anyway, I don't know if you can say that word on YouTube boobs. Anyhow, I think you can. But, um, I guess we'll know soon enough. This girl is pretty. She's humpier here than here. But again, that's, I'm trying to, <sighs> heat from your hands can also help, like, smooth her out. Nah, she's going to require a heating tool. Okay, it does say she's heat safe up to, no, it doesn't, because she's, uh, She's Bobby Boss. Some hundred degrees. Bobby Boss hair is heat safe up to some hundred degrees. 320-ish to four usually. But I would err on the side of less heat than more heat, okay? Just use enough heat to get the job done is my recommendation. Okay, so let's take a look at this girl all the way around. Here she is on my right. Okay, so this is going to be an interesting thing because she's on. So the back is going to be a trick. And then here she is on the left. Now again, she's super duper long all to the front. She's tangling a little. This is one I might wear all the way to the front all the time. She's one I might would even braid and style because of her length and her colors. I think that she would be well suited to possibly a hairstyle. Um, again, she's shedding a bit. It's not terrible, but it's a bit, okay? Yeah. Okay, so does she look like the stock card? Um, yeah. Yeah, I think she does. I don't think she's as full 
as this is saying. She's kind of thin. Y'all, she's a little bit thin. But uh, I think this has just been spread out. You know, how they do. But otherwise, she does look like the stock card. She has that same feathery, you know, layered sides that sort of go back. And then she does go down to your waist. She goes all the way to my waist. Is she big head friendly? Um, I don't know if I'd say that. I don't know if I'd say she's big head friendly. I think she's um, big head adjacent. I'm a 22 and a half inch and I don't have, I won't have to lay her down and she doesn't have much lift. So I would say she's 23 and 23 inch ish friendly. Yeah. You could go all the way up to probably 23 inches without a whole lot of headaches. Okay. Okay. Um, that is all I have for Macaria, Macaria today. Again, she's from Bobby Boss. I got her in the color OL Peacock. Her number is MLF378. There she is in case you want to order her. That's all I have. I'm done. Um, if there is a wig that you would like me to review, please post her information down in the comment section and I will see what I can do for you. While you're there, please click like, leave a comment, share, and smash the notification bell. That way you're alerted every time I upload a video. Okay? Okay. I will see you guys later. Love you. Bye.